Hey folks, this is Vagrant. Welcome back to Elden Ring. In the last video, we defeated Renala, the Queen ish, the leader of the Ray Lucaria Academy. She is the Queen, right? She's the Carrion Royal. But the Carrion family have kind of been uh, eviscerated. She was also abandoned by Radagon? Isn't Radagon the wolf? I don't remember. Anyways, anyways, we're now heading off on a whole new quest and that is to we're looking for like the eternal city or something i don't know we have to go down in a well and it's somewhere near mistwood so we're in mistwood and that's about all i've got for you and i don't know where we're going so we're gonna walk around until we find something <laughs> that's the joke i'm looking for a well okay hello buddy <laughs> oh uh right yeah we're just looking for a well it's quite nice being back in limgrave weirdly I mean, it should be here, right? It should be at the ruins, you'd think. What is that? Is that a bear? Hello, bear. I figured, because we're now higher level, it'll be easy, right? That was my thinking. How many souls was that worth? You know what, for 1100 souls, I'll do that all day. Not a problem, not bad at all. Sorry, Bear, I do feel a little bit guilty. <laughs> Got some gold-tinged poop, though. Uh, this doesn't look like a well. Have I been down here? The door's shut. Mm, it's not a well, but... Wait. 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 Well, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Axe. Oh, sweet. New talisman. Okay. Oh, we can... You know what I mean? We can equip a new talisman. I completely forgot. Um, charge attacks. I don't really use charge attacks. Did I already have one like that? Jump attacks. That might be good. I've started to use jump attacks more. I'm leaning towards that one. Max equip load is good for the future. We don't need that now. We don't need faith. It's only 60. Well, it's 60. Tell you what, that's like two levels worth of uh, health. It's not a bad shout. I don't really see any of us that. It's, it's that one or it's the damage ones. But I feel like I'm getting to that point in the game now. Where my damage is okay and I need to focus on survivability a little bit. But I'm tempted by this. It'd be good to know how much it does. Final hit of a chain. Ah, let's see the problem with that one. I might go for the jump one. I just, I want actual stats, you know? <laughs> I want to know exactly what it does. Let's, let's, let's put it on for now. Cool. I'd really like to get a third, uh, fourth slot. I suspect I can probably still have one by now if I find it. I just don't know where I would go. My nose is incredibly itchy. Nose! Stop it! Nyeh, nyeh, nyeh. Okay, so let's have a little wander around. And see if we can find this well. If I was a well, where would I be? I would be near the ruins, but I wouldn't be in the ruins. I would be, like, on the outskirts of the ruins, personally. If I was a well, that's where I would be. But, you know, I'm, I'm not a well at the end of the day. I'm not. I tried. I want to be a well, but it just wasn't working for me. It just... Hmm. Man, a little bit of guidance from Blythe would have been helpful. Just... Come to Mistwood, go down the well. That's not helpful, Blythe. It's not helpful at all. I'm getting to a point where I'm thinking it's not in the ruins. I am, however, a very bouncy horse. I mean, we've got a new talisman. <laughs> you know, not all, not all bad. Okay, so I've decided it's not in here. Let's just carry on exploring. We'll just explore Mistwood a little bit, see what we can find. See what we can find. Other than creepy music. We need a root resin anyway, so that's good. Hmm. Something up there. Oh, hello. These probably just fragments, right? String? Rickety shield. What's going on here? String, rickety shield, and a falcon. You're a little tough. Oh! 
All right, buddy. All right, all right, no need. Thankfully, he just doesn't do much damage. Just because we, you know, obviously this is the starter area at the end of the day. Okay, I came over to the uh, the tree. Got myself some sunnies. Um, I think I've seen it on the map. I'll show you it. If I zoom in, look there. It's something. It could be a gowl, but it's definitely something. That's all I've got. It's something. It is definitely something. Didn't we? I have a vague recollection of seeing this building at some point in the past. I remember running around this thinking, huh, oh, what's this thing? Okay, but if this is a well, then how would I get inside? Maybe through the door. It's a controversial idea, but we'll give it a go. There's a lot of blood there. There's a lot of blood. Wow, was that not open before? Does that only open... I don't know. I don't... Did I... Mi Either I'm stupid and I never saw the door, or it only opened when we made progress past a certain point. I'm going to live in the hope that it's the latter. This is very shiny and very pretty. Well, this is what we're looking for. This is where Blythe told us to come. Well, next oh, hello. Got a whole underground world here. Very cool. I'm assuming this ties in with where we were before anyway. Yo. Yo, what is this? This place is gigantic. What? What? There's some madness going on here, folks. Some utter, utter madness. Roll. Oh, that was way higher than I thought. <laughs> way higher. That was a little bit risky. Oh, hello. You're not an AM, are you? No. Okay. Okay. Well, we got a new grace, which is cool. We may as well get my FP back. Also curious where we are. Is it connected? Yeah, it is, see? I mean, it's miles away, but it is part of the underground map, at least. Which, um, I have just look at it. If these two connect physically, which, you know, they might well not, but my god, the map could be gigantic. It's already a humongous game, as is. Like, I, I, I could have finished Dark Souls by now. It, it would have been touch and go. It, it would have been a quick playthrough, don't get me wrong, but I, I could have done it. I hear creepy things. Jew kissed Herbert. We've been finding Herbert all game, but now it's been kissed by the Jew. Felcon. Not big on those. It's a co op thing. If you want some jolly cooperation. I'm still considering doing two playthroughs of this game. Is that madness? Will people watch the second playthrough? Let me, let's, right, right. Before we start talking about that, let's finish the bloody game. How's that for a plan? I need to stop thinking about it. It's just because I just want to try all the things I'm not trying, you know? And, but it would ruin my experience to try them now, I think. My character is my character. You know, he has a, he has a way of living and a way of being. I don't want to mess up. I know that might sound like nonsense, but it makes sense to me. Well, whatever that is over there, it's angry. I think it's I think it's the minor guys that we deal with quite a lot. It's a lot of blood though for what would be a fairly regular enemy. It's oct there. Okay. How much damage do you take? Oh! They're all coming. That's why people die. Wait, I can horse up. Okay, this is a good time. Wait, I can horse up. It's rather surprising. Hoping I'm gonna get a flask back when I kill these guys. No one defeats the bouncy horse.
Ah! That pull always gets me. Yeah, there we go. Okay, Clayman's Harpoon. Okay, right now I can enter the building through the middle, but let's keep exploring. Oh, rip. <laughs> Maybe you can come here early. This would be another fairly terrifying location to enter like super early game. Which I love, I love that you can do that. The game's like, you know, you can come down here if you want, you'll get slaughtered. But if you want to give it a go, you know, more power to you, kid. Live your dreams. Man, I've got Herbert for days. It's a little creepy. It's a vibe. A very spooky vibe. It's because of the music as well. It keeps kind of going... You know what I mean? That makes sense. It did seem there wasn't enough enemies there. Ow. They're actually really annoying because they don't... Oh! Oh, hello! <laughs> okay. It did seem suspicious that there was only one. Undestructible right here. Indestructible. I'm gonna heal up because I think I'll get one back. Yeah? Yeah. Good stuff. Silver Firefly, more Herber, Golden Rune 4, Smithing Stone 4. Could this be the time for Smithing Rune 5? There's item over there. Soap. Soap? What's soap do? I mean, I know. Shut up. <laughs> Someone definitely instantly thought, I can make a joke, I can make a joke. <laughs> um, if I was soap, where would I be? Hmm. Actually, not sure. Oh, the soap's gone. Oh, that's there. Removes filth and accumulations on the body. Hmm. My first thought is to try to give that to uh, the dung eater. Well, he might take offense at that. You don't have the right. You don't have the right. You don't have the right. Oh, by the way, you don't have the right. Man, isn't that beautiful? I like how they play a lot more with color in this game. Dark Souls 1 is very... There's, there's varieties in environment and stuff for sure, but it's not a, it's not a colourful game. Whereas Elden Ring actually is in a weird way. It's unexpected, I would suggest. They always all wake up, don't they? Yeah. Ah, messed up. Gotta avoid the bubbles. Nothing else matters but avoiding the bubbles. The bubble! <laughs> no! Alright, and heal up again. Same deal as last time. Yep. Yeah. Nope. I was punished for my hubris. Oh, it's because there's one alive down there. Okay, that's fine. Rainbow Stone. Jokest Hubba. You are all that stands behind between me and power. Right. That hit for 290, actually, can you go away for a sec? Eh, I mean, 38 more damage, I guess isn't bad. It's decent. 
I mean, if I could find an item that just straight up said do 38 more damage, <laughs> I would absolutely use it, right? So I guess that same deal, in a way. Might jump, yep. Yeah. I have to, have to every now and again make sure I'm jump building. Okay. I guess I'm gonna keep going. I don't think I need to come down here. I think we need to go that way, but there might be some loot down here, you know. You know how it be. Man, I'm really bad at avoiding that. <laughs> Wait for it. There we go. <laughs> Oh, so close. It's so close to being a two-hit kill. Agonizingly so. It's such a weird environment. Come on, you. Don't go back in. Don't go back in. There we go. Where is my flask? Give me my flask. There it is. All right, that must mean they're all dead. Very interesting. Okay. How would one climb here? So what was that? Yeah, I knew I saw something. Gold? There's a... Where? <laughs> What's the golden centipede? Okay, uh, there it is. Oh, it is, a, it is a crafting item. Okay. Maybe they've existed before and I've just never seen them. Okay, I think I've cleared out most of this entire area by now. The next challenge then is trying to get up there. So I didn't really explore this right inside, did I? Nope. Got mushies for days, son. Mushies for days. Oh, maybe. I mean, dead? No. <laughs> uh, uh, da, 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 da. Hole ahead. Yeah, I believe you. People just do this to just trick you. <laughs> People are mean. Um. Okay, so how would... If you were a, a, a person, a human, right? Imagine you're a human. How would you get up there? Okay, are these respawning or did I not come down here either? Because I've never seen so much Herbert in my life. And I've seen a lot of Herbert in my life. I tell you, I am the Herbie boy, as they call me in the clubs. And I've never experienced this much Herber. Man. There's something flashing down there, rather annoyingly. Um, we can keep it in mind. I always say that, but I, ne I never end up getting the things that I keep in mind. I'm just wondering if this connects with something. It's there. Oh, wait, I can just go this way. herp derp I don't know what I'm going to do with all these herpers. Bear with me. Bear with me. I think those ones only ever give flasks, the red ones. But I like to make sure. <laughs> just kill them just in case, you know? You never know, folks. You never know. Okay. Oh, well, this is not... Budding corn. Okay, but maybe... Ah, okay, yeah, this is looking promising. I think we have to do it on the horse. I don't know if we do, actually. I, do, I feel like the horse might be a terrible idea. Yeah, 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 yeah. And that's why. It's a little harder to control. To say, I'm going to hop off. Oh! <laughs> okay, I think this is promising, though. 
This is very promising. Great jumping lies ahead. He's a booble boy. Also go over there. <laughs> that I might do on the horse, just in case. I'm gonna do that on the horse. Mm, but we need to do that before we drop down. So we need to go do that first. Come on, Torrent buddy. I don't get to use you much at the moment, so. Just in case, folks, just in case. I think it would have been is there really nothing here? Oh no! <laughs> oh, that's so cruel! <laughs> Bastards. I, I'm sure sometimes they, they put something like this in, knowing that people will see this and think, yep, yeah, we have to go that way. We have to we have to try that out. You cheeky little pliers. Alright, I need to jump, I think, onto the lower platform first, like so. And then just plop. Come back here. Oracle bubble. Hey, we learned how to make pupils. I don't even know what the other thing I got was. <laughs> I was distracted by the little beetle. Right. 26 minutes into the bloody video, <laughs> I suddenly feel okay to move on. I feel like we've explored this whole area pretty bloody well. It's just everything holds secrets, you know, everything holds secrets. I've got a really nice room collection going as well, so we're going to save those to the end. Basically, what I'm going to do is keep going until I find something... I really want to buy, and I don't want to grind for the runes, or until things start to get super difficult, and then we just pop all the runes and hopefully level up a couple more times. I've got them in reserve, basically. I don't feel the need to level up right now, so I'm not going to, essentially. Because in the chat, what can I say? Right, this area's even bloody bigger. <laughs> oh! Oh! No. <laughs> I got excited then. It looks... Very, very similar. It's clearly meant to be the same architecture. There's a word I'm looking for. It's very clearly the same architecture as where I was last time when we came underground, right? This is suspicious. Preserving boluses. Okay. I think those are the uh, anti-blood things. It's definitely meant to be the same environment, though, isn't it? The architecture's the same. The colouring's the same. Not the ant tunnels, but when we got into the main area, for sure. Why is this random dude carrying three beast lovers? What's he been up to? What's his story? That's the question. What's his story? I swear that lantern moved. <laughs> You're not dead. Oh, it's a crab. I'm sorry, crab. <laughs> I just had to make sure. I didn't know what it was. No, it's pissed. I'm sorry, crab. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Um, what if it riles up all the other crabs? Man, it's proving hard to target because of the freaking crabs and it's cockroach thing. Not cockroach. Crosshopper. What's it called? Flying thing. Dragonfly. There we go. I got it just in time. Uh, this crab's in a very awkward position. But now I've got its babies. I don't know what to do yet. I can't really. I really don't want to die. Ah, no! <laughs> They've been inspired! Now they must all die. I 
was hoping for another flask. <laughs> I might have been optimistic. Well, clearly was optimistic. Tell you what, we upgraded our flask so much in the early game, but that's not happened in ages. I haven't found an upgrade item. I suppose we haven't been to a new area in a really long time. Like, when did we get to the lakes? That was ages ago. But this, this is sort of a new area, but it's not quite the same thing, I guess. If that crab was out in the bloody open, it would have been fine. I only just did so much damage because it's stuck behind the goddamn tree. Oh, hello. I know, I went there, didn't I? Oh, it's a mushroom. I want the mushroom. Behold, mushroom. Yes, I <laughs> actually predicted it perfectly. Oh, God. You just get a feeling for the game. I hear a whistle. I definitely did hear a whistle before. So that's Blythe, right? Because when we first met Blythe, he was up on the ruins and he was... He was whistling at me. And then we did the emote and he came down. And then we got killed by a bat. So he's here somewhere. We're trying to find, so this is not the eternal city, but we're trying to find our way. Whoa. I mean, Whoa. <laughs> We're trying to find our way to the Eternal City. Okay. Where are we now? I'm most curious. Siofra River Bank. So I know the well we came down was Siofra River. River? Siofra River. Siofra River? <laughs> well. We, oh, this is it's really nice. It's like a full-on open world, you know, I can I can mount up, there's deer. It's 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 a whole world in a way that I really didn't expect. It's very cool. I wonder if there's a map. It means there's a lot of exploring to do. That's okay. Exploring's cool. We can have herbs. Decided to be American. Herbs and mushrooms. Since we've decided apparently we can just ignore letters at our whim, why not ignore the M at the start of Mushroom? You know, if you're going to ignore the H in Herb, why not the M in Mushroom? Explain that to me, America. Explain that to me, eh? Doesn't make sense. Can't just ignore the H. It exists. It's not a silent H, for God's sake. Oh, I messed that up so bad. Herb! <laughs> I'm angry. <laughs> I'll take it out on the deer. Okay, well, let's go left first, I guess. Need to work our way through this area. What I need to find, actually, is a bloody map fragment. Oh, they're all coming. They're all coming. They're all angry. I'm, just, I'm very aware of how much I hated these enemies in the past. Not really these guys, but... The, the magic version of these guys. Remember the guy firing the giant arrow at me? Quite a few episodes back when we were going to Altus. And he absolutely ruined me. <laughs> so I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm just slightly aware of that as we move forward. It's, it's, slightly, it's just there at the back of my mind. Okay. What is this? Huh, maybe I've got to light a few of these to progress. These obelisks, okay. All right, well, we've gone left, we've done left. Left is done, good job left. High five. Area is humongous. All right, I'm gonna wrap around. I don't know what I expected, but this is not it. Crazy. <laughs> I don't have anything to add beyond that, really. I'm sorry, Piggy. I unironically did not mean to kill you there. I mean, you did kind of run into me, so it's not really my fault, but... Still, <laughs> doesn't mean I don't feel bad about it. Ah, okay, so we came from over there. We went that way. We've done that whole bit there. It's not a chest, is it? What is that? 
It's a rock. Vagrant, it's a rock. Get some silver fireflies. I don't know what they're for, but we'll get the men away. I think we should maybe explore in blocks. So we're going to do this first block. Before we carry on that way any further, this is my first marker here. These, these pillars. So I want to do everything before going past these large stones. For example, there's a teleporter for some reason. Um... Okay, interesting. Well, we've got we've got a sight of grace that we can come back to. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, I can't kill it. Run, run! I did not expect that <laughs> to be quite so aggro. Hello, turtle. Could this be a dog? I love that. That's that's like the big Elden Ring meme at the moment. Everything's a dog. Reminds me of um, Dark Souls Two. People used to call it a dragon a horse. Is that Blythe? Oh, it is! Hey! Hey, buddy. Wait, I don't want to talk to you yet. Oh, mmm. There's a... Oh, God. This whole... Man, this area's thrown me for a bloody loop. Alright, let me just finish exploring this section, because I don't think there's much left here, anyway. Other than the teleporter. And, you know, that whole thing over there. Other than that, there's not much here. What are you doing? All right, boys. All right, I get it. I get it. You're pissed. Whoa. You know what? So am I. Okay. So is this the this is the Sioff Road River? That's all we know it as name wise, right? Yeah. Why is that one obelisk on fire? It's right for sus. Just gonna okay, let's we'll check this. Hey! Oh that's very helpful. Okay. So is that the marker I said I wasn't going past? Must be, right? Yeah. So I've explored What the hell? What the hell? It goes left? Although, that does not look traversable to me. It goes down here. It goes over there. Is there like an entire underground world behind, underneath Elden Ring? Unironically. That seems like madness, doesn't it? <laughs> that seems silly. <laughs> that seems like that's far too big. What nonsense have you come up with, Miyazaki? Although, unsurprisingly, this game, as I apparently learned today, has been in development, started development before Sekiro did. Sekiro being their last game that we played here on the channel. I never actually completed it. I couldn't kill the final boss, much to my shame. Sekiro, much more than these games, is very reliant on parrying, and parrying has never really been my my, my uh, skill set. My temptation to go back and finish it is always there, it must be said, because leaving a game unfinished on the final boss um, hurts my soul quite a lot. But uh, we'll see. I'm just going to finish exploring this area. And then we'll go talk to Blythe. And then we'll head past there and go explore all this and whatever that is and have a grand old time, I suppose. Oh, hello. Arteria leaf. Melted mushroom. Inverted hawk heater shield. Uh, oh, hello. I didn't see that before. Uh, I'm sure some people saw that loot for the first time as well. I'm like, oh, hey, we should go get that. Bloop. Off the edge they go. Me, I should use my big brain. Unironically, I probably would have jumped if I hadn't seen the blood. But uh, I did. I see blood everywhere. Damn it. Once he starts this combo, like, these guys are easy to interrupt. Oh! Whoa! 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 I'm stuck, man! I'm stuck! Ah! Ah! Like, I died about two inches from the respawn point, but A, I hate dying anyway. It's stupid. 
B. That was stupid as well. <laughs> this was me being dumb. Revenge. I'm sorry, Torrent. I didn't really need you for that, buddy. Is that me? <laughs> it could be. I do have a big, massive sword. Think you're hot, don't you? Bam! Oh, it didn't work. You do do more damage when attacking from behind, though. That's very close. <laughs> okay. So, I mean... Yeah, it's fine. Ooh, Armourer's Cookbook. Mm, I know I didn't have all these bonuses before. Throw to douse enemy with a cursed blood. Build up sleep. Build frost. Deadly poison. Tons of arrows. Cool. Right, let's go talk to Blythe. No, wait, no, not yet. Not yet, sorry. <laughs> of course not. There's always other things. Um, we want to go check out this bit on the right hand side. This little bit here. Then we'll go talk to Blythe. I wonder how many people have gone. <laughs> keep calling him Blade. Uh, no enemy ahead. Do I believe that? I don't know if I believe that. It certainly looks like an enemy. But maybe it's a good lad. Are you a good lad? You chill? You, oh, maybe you are chill. I can't target you. Uh... <laughs> Why? Is it asleep? Is it dead? I'm not going to lie, my overwhelming temptation is to hit it. I'm going to go talk to Blythe first. If there's any loot on the outskirts. I mean, it's got to be relevant somehow, right? It's not going to just be lying there and this whole area doesn't do anything. Surely? I mean, I guess it builds up the story. <laughs> I'm not sure how or what it means, but that's never really been Elden Ring's purview anyway, so I wouldn't change much. Oh, you can get down there. Interesting. Is there any reason to is the question? Go on then. There's always a reason. Horn bow. Horn swoggle. Oh, <laughs> wasn't totally sure on that one, if I'm honest, but um, paid off. Okay, right now we'll go talk to life. Thank good you got mid-air movement on this thing. Meh. I'll do that. Am I far enough away that they'll leave me alone? <laughs> They're all charging down the hill towards me. Life! Save me! Okay. I'm surprised at how accurate these guys are. Right, you're backing off. You've learned your lesson. Tell the others what you saw here today. Let them know that this world is protected. Hey, Blythe. Ah. Good to see you. You're much larger than Apologies, me. Apologies, mate. I'm just staring at your crotch. Well, I don't have much to report. <laughs> I can see bloody Nokron right above me, but I'm absolutely stumped. I've tried all the gateways, to no avail. Perhaps it's time to ask Celebus. I recall that spiteful little rat acting like he knew something. Let's give him a squeeze. Show him just how sharp my teeth are. Oh. I jest. Besides, uh, I should check on some things here. Leave this place to me. You just do what you feel is right. If either of us learns anything, we tell the other. Right? 
Leave this for either of us. And if we reach a dead end, I suppose we go back to the source. Celebus rarely gives a straight answer. First time. Leave this place to either of us learns and if we reach Celebus rarely gives a straight down. Okay. So by the sounds of it, the city is there. And we don't know how to get there. Maybe we can figure it out. But we'll go back and talk to Celebus. But I want to explore this whole area first. Ooh. I'm a flyy pony. Whee. Okay, didn't expect to go quite this high. Interesting. Only slightly terrifying. Okay. Neither. Oh. <laughs> Well, I'm not getting across there anytime soon. Although, there's someone over there. There's someone just standing there at the end. Maybe the teleporter takes me over there. We'll have to check that teleporter out when we get back. Oh, sweet. That always a good thing to get. I fucked up. <laughs> I knew it. I, I th Shut up. I thought I could go that side as well. I obviously couldn't. Mistakes were made. It's fine. As long as I get those runes back, we haven't really lost anything. <sighs> Back we go. It's a really cool area. There's a lot to do still. Like I said, I, I've got this whole area behind these pillars. This whole <laughs> bit here is still up for exploration. But not quite yet. He That's what it sounds like, though. Music's brilliant here, as it must be said. I know I want to drop down to a lower level, which is part of what my thinking was. I can just drop down. But uh might want to do that at the correct... Whoa. 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 There they are. Hello, lovely. Okay. So I don't think I drop down here. Maybe I don't drop down. It just it looks like I do. Do I jump across? How do we even get back, honestly? I've decided to drop down. <laughs> I'm going to hop off for a little bit. It looks like there may be a pathway there. Nope. Okay. This is freaking terrifying. I'm pretty tense right now. <laughs> okay, I think we can drop down now. I want to check this side just in case. No, okay. That's safe, right? That's got to be safe. Oh, no, there, 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 there. Okay. It's the music, man. It it's, it's constantly feels like it's building to something non-stop. It's very spooky. There we go. Well, that wasn't really worth it, but we explored. Exploring is cool. Da 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 <laughs> da da da. Right, okay, so let's do this right-hand ridge first, this whole grassy knoll area that I'm on now. Let's see what we can see. All right, big boy, calm down. He's very excited about the whole idea. It's just, there's this, like, constant tension, I feel. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's back. Arrow Boy is back. What are you doing now? Stop that. I think he's like a bell guy, isn't he? I might die here. 
I ran out of stamina. I was being stupid. I'm ashamed. I've died quite a lot here. Bloody Nora, look at them. This this area has killed me a few times. It's nice. It's fun. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not. I'm not sad about it. Like I've had it easy for a while in some ways, and the game is just now nicely reminding me. You know what? You're weak and you're stupid, and everything will kill you. <laughs> Pay attention, damn it, best in slot, vagrant Connor. My name is Connor. Gosh darn it! Pay attention, Connor, or you'll die. That's good. So that's a good life lesson. You know. Well, it's 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 a life lesson. <laughs> That's, it's a life. Oh, oh, I nearly went for that. You know, I so nearly went for that. It's it's a life lesson. It is quite a lot of runes. How are you ever? Meant to dodge that one, rubbish. No, stop it. Thank you. What? I think this is another one I like, yeah. I keep following the grassy bit through. Oh my god. Ah, I'm so close. I'm so close. Jeez, these things are brutal. Absolutely brutal. They were brutal last time and they're brutal now. Oh my god, there's another one somewhere. Oh no! No! <laughs> look at me! I look ridiculous. Okay, well, I'm gonna have a little poke up here. There's another teleporter up here. Which is curious. Oh, I'm so tempted. You know what? This one's a bit more annoying to find. Let's 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 check it out. Let's just see where we end up. Uh, are we in the same area? Oh, oh, I'm, I'm on the higher section, aren't I? I've gone up. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. 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 Yeah, <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, we've been, we've been raised up. So I can walk on mountains. Oh, it's like an infinity pool. I'll stay away from that bit, I think. Crabs must be loving it up here. Absolutely loving it. Oh, hello. Slumbering egg. Oh. Well. Okay, well, a little exploration of this top bit as well. Goes on for a while in that direction. Also assuming we can at some point find a way down, maybe? <laughs> maybe? I'm not seeing it right now. Or a great sight for that matter. 
Okay, we can go down there. There's a building over here, though. <sighs> this feels like one of those areas that I'm never going to get everything. There's just so many little things here and there, you know, that I just don't see how I'm going to get every item. Nothing up here, is there? Sure is a lot of enemies. Oh god, they're not taking any damage either. Okay. Interesting. It's not like they're doing a ton either, but... They're taking less than their friends were before. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> that roll forward was very optimistic. I didn't realize the explosion was quite so big. Oh my god! Damage, man! Oh, come on! Man! Now nah, I'm sad forever. I'm just being stupid. It makes me sad. Oh, those bubbles are transparent. That's cool. <laughs> um. Oh, sweet. Oh, is that up here? That would make me happy. Good way to not put a grey site up here, I suppose. Certainly looks like it. Wait, I'm in I'm in Nocron. But Nocron was wait, I made that wait what? <laughs> so many questions. Maybe I don't kill these guys. Maybe I just run in and get the item. Is that cowardice? Yeah, sure. <gasps> Tier 5! Tier 5! Come here. I'm not interested in you lads. Tier 5! We can upgrade our sword! Hype. Absolute hype. Just, just. Where am I? What am I doing? <laughs> Nobody knows. Nobody will ever know. <laughs> So this is that top, yeah. It doesn't look like it's necessarily going to lead anywhere, which is fine. You know, it can just be for loot. Although there's a thing over there as well. Okay. Yes, Elden Ring, sad face. <laughs> I mean, it's not sad. It's very cool. I love the this crazy openness and everything. It's just, uh, it can be a little overwhelming at times. Always worth checking. Hmm. Hmm. Rather suspicious, aren't you, my friend? It does feel silly to do anything without upgrading my weapon. Uh, what was the dragon wound grease I just got? Because that looks like a dragon. Does it wound dragons? No. Um. I'm, I, my problem is, I, I kind of want to go back to the grey site, right? And then come back here in a minute. I'm not saying we're not going to do it. We are obviously going to do it. But I'd like to go upgrade my weapon, first of all. I'd also like to spend my souls before I try something boss-shaped. Um, my problem is I actually don't know how to get back down. Whoa. 
but uh oh finished. Should be fine, right? Yeah, a little ropey than I expected. Um How do I get back down? Unironically, how do I get back down? Like how do I <laughs> how wait, I can just teleport. Why am I being stupid? Okay, cool. Okay, so we're just gonna... Uh... Ah, that's how you do it. All right, cool. Okay, we're gonna go upgrade our weapon, and then I guess at the start of the next video we'll go... I mean, I don't know if it's a boss, but it certainly looked like a boss, didn't it? It had a boss aesthetic, <laughs> so... Uh. What are you doing? Oh, you know what else we need to do that I completely forgot about? Let's go take our um, spooky things to Spooky Boy. That's the wrong way. We got... Um, the, uh, the the grave thing I can't the death blossom or whatever it's called I can't remember. Anyways, we got we got some of that and we haven't used well, it yet. I took you for no matter. It's all out. You're up. Yeah. Okay. So Dex and strength both stay at D, C, D and C, but we gain forty more damage. Pretty hype. Oh, look at that. Look at that! Strength scaling goes to a C on the next level. So this is, yeah, this is a quality weapon. As in, we want to go quality build, right? It's going to level with strength and dex, as, I, as I've explained how quality works in the past. Alright, that's very exciting for me. Very erotic, ooh. We have a lot of spiffing sounds. End of the game, we're selling all these. <laughs> For one final level push, as need be. Don't need these. Uh, no, intellect. Ugh. I'm gonna sell that. I, I love it, but it's got a faith requirement. And I'm just, I'm trying to just focus on strength and dex for this build. That's not good, is it? No. 100. Oh, it's got parry. That's cool. I keep my shields. Uh, I keep all my weed helmets. <laughs> Didn't get any armor. All right, sweet. Very excited about that. So yeah, the other thing I wanted to do. Let's go here. I'll have a quick little chat with him, and then we'll end up. And then next video, big boy time. What are these little effects that I keep getting? Got you. I got you a present, buddy. Nom nom. Nom nom. Nom 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 nom. He's very bloodborne, isn't he? I am not sated. Feed me more death. Is that a good idea? Me gives me things, <laughs> but I don't know if I want to feed the guy who wants more death. Is that a, is that a tip top idea? I don't know. I don't know. Right. So we're gonna. Okay, next video. We're going to go back up the teleporter. We're going to check out whatever that big thing in the lake is. And we're going to come back down. Probably check out the other teleporter as well. And then that'll be this sort of rough area done. And then we need to look over there. And then that should be it. And then we need to go back to Selenus, who's obviously... He's back in the lakes at the northwest in the tower. And we need to talk to him anyway, because I tried to give that potion to that lass. And she completely rejected it, so... I want to do that. Thank you for joining me. Cheers, much as always. Bye-bye.